In this video, I will talk about the main steps to successfully upgrade to MySQL 8. First, you have to keep in mind that you must prepare your migration plan. You should proactively identify all the changes brought by the new MySQL version that will have an impact on your databases and your application. Especially incompatible changes, but also variables and features added, deprecated and deleted. During this preliminary checks phase, you should verify if your MySQL instance is ready for upgrade. MySQL Shell provides a tool, the Check for Server Upgrade command, which automates this task for MySQL versions 5.7 and 8.0. This utility, which must be run on the instance to be upgraded, provides a report which displays the result of the various items checked. All you have to do is fix any problems. Then you and your MySQL instance are ready for the next step. A very important point before upgrading your production is to meticulously test your application with MySQL 8. This will allow you to anticipate any possible problems that you could not identify in the previous steps. Architecture based on MySQL replication or MySQL InnoDB cluster with MySQL group replication could help you to seamlessly integrate and test MySQL 8. Another very, very important point is to mastering your backup and restore process. Your backup is your main safeguard. It is therefore imperative to do a backup before the upgrade. And then comes the long-awaited moment, upgrade to MySQL 8. There are two kinds of upgrade. In place upgrade, where you will need to stop the MySQL instance, upgrade the binary, then start the MySQL instance. And logical upgrade, where you will have to dump your data, stop the MySQL instance, remove the data deer, upgrade the binary, load the dump, then upgrade the system tables. The last step is to make sure everything went well. Check your MySQL and applications log, carefully check your monitoring as well as the behavior of your application. Et voilà! I recommend these few links that will allow you to deepen this topic. Thanks for using MySQL!